Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on Supergirl Season 6. Today we're going to be talking about the final season, and we've got some official new news that we need to talk about. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new, so you don't miss any DCTV videos later this year or in Supergirl's final season, which is coming out next year. Okay, so yeah, we've got the official announcement in regards to how long they are filming and when they are going to, and it kind of gives us a rough date on when we're going to see Supergirl come out. So this is very interesting because David Harewood released his post on Instagram just the other day when they started because it was day one. You see him, he's like fully suited up in his Martian Manhunter suit and everything. So everyone's back, everyone has done quarantine because they've officially started production. There was a delay which was about a week or so but that was due to testing, but now it's all good in Vancouver. So production has begun on Supergirl's final season, and they have 10 more months to go. 10 more months, that is crazy, and we need to talk about that, and that is the main point of topic in today's video, considering the fact that Supergirl and the other shows normally only film for 9 months, and so why are they there for so long? So I'm going to be answering that in today's video. So, yeah. The original date was set for April 5th, there was a document that went out and I have access to this document and maybe some of you guys have seen it. It has all the official start dates and end dates for all the shows shooting in Vancouver. So currently right now The Flash is staying the same, its May date is staying the same for its ending when it finishes filming for this season. Same with Legends finishing at the start of May, same with Superman Lois and so on. So. Supergirl is the only show that has changed and upped its episode count and upped its filming dates. So it was originally set to end on April 5th, which was earlier than all the other shows, so we were like, okay, so is Supergirl going to get like a much shorter season? Is it going to be like 15 episodes or something like that? And then we heard the date around May 19th, like it was going to be extended a bit, but no, it's changed and it's going to be 10 months from when they started, and that end date is now... August the 6th. That is a hell of a long time away, so we need to talk about this. So basically, I'm guessing they're going to have longer breaks in their filming. Obviously, every time they go on break, they're probably going to have a longer break because they're going to have to do a two week quarantine when they come back. So they're going to accommodate for that. And therefore, I would say, and I talked to this, so this information does come from Monroe. Some of you guys might know her. She helps me out in some of these videos with the information. And so she suggested the idea that Supergirl would finish earlier for Christmas break. So they would break kind of in the middle of December, unlike the other CW shows which film up till Christmas Eve, and then break for longer so that, you know, they can return, say, at the end of January. That would be my guess, and that is Monroe's guess. So I would say I'm aligning with that. I would say they're probably going to have like a kind of two month break nearly during Christmas time. And considering the fact that they're doing 20 episodes, I don't think they're going to have any other extensive breaks. Even though it seems like it's such a long time, 10 months, you know, they will have breaks here and there. But I guess they just won't be able to leave the country if the restrictions are the same. They will probably have breaks from filming, but they'll have to stay in Vancouver, that being the cast and crew. However, I don't think there is going to be any more big breaks because they have to get through 20 episodes and even with breaks included, that's still a long time that they have to film for because it's a lot of episodes and they normally do this in about 9 months every year. Obviously they have the Christmas break, I think they have a break around Easter, they have a few breaks here and there and then, you know, it kind of amounts to 9 months staying in Vancouver doesn't mean 9 months of shooting, it's probably about you know, eight months or so shooting normally. So if you add in everything, this kind of 10 month period seems a lot, but it kind of makes quite a bit of sense. So now, August 6th, what does this mean? Because, you know, this is a long time away. Currently we're in October, they started production in October. You have literally nearly a whole year that they're gonna be filming. They're two months shy of a year long production. So it's very, very big and it's gonna be a big operation, obviously with all the restrictions that they're gonna to have to deal with. I guess it's better that they have more time. But when is Supergirl going to come out if they finish filming in August? Well, you guys know we normally premiere the CW shows around October time. And by this time, they normally have filmed about three to four episodes, I think as I recall is correct. So, 
with Supergirl starting in October and it not premiering in January like the other Arrowverse shows like The Flash, Superman, and Lois, Batwoman, basically what they're going to do is a similar formula where in that they are still filming when the season comes out. So say Supergirl season 6 comes out in May or maybe it comes out in June or even later in July or something but my best guess right now is about June slash May time they're probably still going to be filming and like I said they're going to probably have longer breaks and by the time they get to that premiere episode whenever it actually happens they're still going to be filming. So with this I would say the release date is probably going to stay the same it's probably going to be like May time and because they started shooting so early in October I think it may be a precaution that they're doing so they start filming earlier they can get out of the way they can have the episodes in the bag they're probably going to have like 15 episodes in the bag by the time that they've actually got to the premiere of episode one for this season so you know then they would have say like five more episodes to shoot and they would do that over the say next two months or so after the season's premiere so i mean it makes a lot of sense when you think about it if they start october 13th and then they end august 6th because that means they have longer breaks but also at the same time they're not rushed for time normally they are a little bit rushed and that's why they like to start you know kind of at the start of july or you know towards the end of july so they get a few months ahead but with this they are so far ahead that it's no problem like if there's any restrictions they have to delay by a couple of weeks due to say testing in vancouver or something having this amount of time is going to be great for them and yeah they're going to be in vancouver longer but at the same time it's very hard to travel around right now like in the entire world because there is restrictions everywhere so it makes sense if they are there but then they're also free at the same time so what do you guys think about that that is absolutely crazy when i saw the figure that it was 10 months to go like i was like what are they filming like 30 episodes or something but you know since i thought about it and i kind of came up with a few theories it kind of all makes sense to me now so let me know, do you think it makes sense and do you think that they're going to do what I think they're going to do? And so just quickly before we end this video, in regards to Supergirl and them filming right now, the reason why you haven't seen them out on the street is because they are doing studio work and I mentioned this in my Flash video over the last few days. Basically, they're going to do probably like a week or maybe a week or so inside and they're going to get that stuff done and then they're going to go outside and do the kind of more tricky stuff because there's going to be more health regulations kind of in a studio set they have more control and that's why they're probably going to do that stuff first and then they will go out into the public where it's a bit more risky in terms of the virus and so they have to heavily regulate that and set that for a specific time and be very careful so we should start seeing them out on the street in the next few weeks and we'll get photos from the set like we got with the flash go check out yesterday's video because i broke down all the first looks at the flash season 7 we had iris we had camilla we had barry we had mirror mistress also i did a video like a couple weeks ago when batwoman actually had its first look released as well again by canada grouse and so we're gonna get this very soon with supergirl and don't expect any kind of promotion for Supergirl for quite a long time considering it's not coming out in the slew of new CW Arrowverse releases in January. Yes, they'll be filming whilst these other shows are filming. That's where you're going to get your information for now. You're going to get it from the set rather than by any trailers or promos they release because they probably won't release that until like March time or something like that. It's going to be quite a while until we get our official first look like I mean in terms of posters trailers or promos so yeah be on the lookout for all of that I'm sure we're gonna see them in the public very soon so thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for supporting me please be sure to check out my new videos every single day they come out I will also be starting a live stream that I'm gonna do weekly very very soon I'm gonna release that date somehow and I'm gonna let you guys all know via Twitter YouTube Instagram or whatever you use so be on the lookout for that but for now thank you guys for watching and I will catch you guys later goodbye